So here's a little bit of an overview of what we've done so far throughout the entire course and uh, what, we, uh, what I'm thinking I'll cover and how I'm going to structure it. So, um, right, we've already seen the introduction, installing Go, and putting your development to environment together. In this section, we're going to look at computer fundamentals, so how computers work. So if you already are familiar with this, you know, then you could jump ahead. But, um, yeah, I've been teaching this for like almost two decades. <laughs> so I've got it pretty streamlined about how to convey how computers work. So it might be interesting just to drop in and check it out, even if you already sort of have a good understanding. Uh, at least just see, like, how's another pe person present it. And then after that, we're going to look at, like, the language fundamentals, so some basic syntax. And then we'll look at control flow fundamentals. And then we'll look at, like, data structure fundamentals. And that's a whole lot of fundamentals, so I might see if I come up with some other way to name all that. And then we'll look at program composition. And, uh, and then I think I just give a whole bunch of exercises and, and like you could try those exercises and work them and then I'll also provide, you know, uh, the solutions to those. Um, so uh, that's, that's my idea. We'll see how it evolves. But here in Computer Fundamentals, what we're going to look at, what we're going to learn is we're going to learn uh, how computers work. <laughs> and uh, so we'll see all about circuits and the generations of computers. Maybe I'll, I'll talk about that briefly. And how circuits, you know, are the real foundation, just this on-off state, and how we could take that and encode certain meaning uh, to different on-off states and different combinations. So circuits and coding schemes, and we'll look at text encoding, like ASCII and UTF-8. And then we'll also look at numeral systems, like binary and hexadecimal and, and uh, decimal. And then we'll also... Uh, you know, we've already done the terminal, so we don't, we don't need that one. But just a little bit of a background in how computers work. So uh, that's what's coming up in this section.